There must be something special about it that makes so many people love the theme this much. Promotion attributes everywhere. The promotion grid on the homepage, collection promotion banners, content sections on the product page to promote your brand, and even footer promotions. Pretty responsive, right? Hi, welcome back to the Shopify theme review series by Pagefly Team. I'm June and in today's video, we are going to give you our honest review of a premium Shopify theme called Impulse. Impulse is designed by the Akatai theme developer, it is not a free theme and you can buy it with a price of 180 US dollars. But don't worry because after today's video, we are going to have the Impulse theme giveaway soon. So if you want to be the lucky winner to get the Impulse theme for free, make sure to subscribe to our page for our YouTube channel, follow us on Facebook and Twitter to get the latest updates about the giveaway event. Now get back to the theme, as you can see here, Impulse is a premium theme with more than 90% of positive reviews on the Shopify theme store, out of more than 400 feedbacks. That's a big number, right? There must be something special about it that makes so many people love the theme this much. So what are we waiting for? Let's delve right into it to find out the answer. What you're looking at here is the Shopify editor board after I installed the Impulse theme and built a demo store. If you haven't created a Shopify store yet, you can check out the 14 day free trial link in the description box below. We also have a detailed review article about the Impulse theme, so you can check out there too if you want. Now, about the Impulse themes header and footer. There are some special features in these sections, so I want to address them first before we deep dive into the homepage product and collection pages features. So we are going to look at the header first. Impulse is a theme that can support store with large inventories and they have a pretty cool mega menu feature. The mega menu feature is the drop down menu when you create menu items in the navigation section. And it's cool because you can see the drop down items are set up in columns, which is very organized even when you have large menu. And you can choose to show the mega menu images, which can be a unique part of your store that can interest people when they browsing your site. Apart from that, you can set up other things like logo, announcement bar, language and currency selectors. And you can choose header style, like do you want it to be overlay header or sticky header. Our recommendation is you should choose sticky header because it's better for navigation. When people scroll down your pages, they can still navigate to other pages easily. For the footer, you can set up menu items in footer and add your custom info there. But I want you to pay attention to the footer promotions here. You can add images, tag CDA buttons to promote your content pages right in the footer. And if you don't want to show it on the home page, but just other pages, you can totally choose this option. And another thing I want to mention is the pop up section. It's not in the footer or header, but it can be shown in any pages. So I want to point that out. You can enable pop up to promote your brand or events and acquire the newsletter signups. This is cool for a premium theme because it helps avoid adding pop up apps into your store. You don't want to add many apps. It can slow down your size. So this is a plus point of the impulse theme. All right. Let's move to the homepage features. With homepage features, the first thing you would notice is the edge-to-edge -edge slideshow banners. Many big brands using Impulse themes like Gapper or Penny Skateboard utilize these features to showcase their cool hero banners. 
You can add images separately for desktop and mobile versions. And I can see that in Paul's theme developers, they do care a lot about mobile version. You can adjust image height on mobile to make it look more responsive. And in general, the mobile layout of Impulse theme is pretty responsive. We just have a recommendation that you should prepare image sizes before creating your store if you want big and high quality banners. If you don't know which sizes are good, the Impulse Support has a very detailed article about image and video size recommendations. So I'll put the link in the description box. You can check out there. For content customization, you can add rich tags, large image with tags, show collections and featured collection on the homepage, add testimonials, news and so on. And video features. The theme has powerful video features with many options like video hero or large video with text box. All right, you can see that Impulse can offer many customization features than normal free themes, but the factor that make Impulse stand out is the promotion grid feature here. It's a powerful and robust feature. You can add advanced promotion banners with big headings and CDA buttons, image banners, sales collections, or product promotion banners. I think these promotion ties are true sales boosters because having them on the homepage makes your store very tempting to visitors and when you look at the mobile version the promotion ties are very organized and cutting edge so this is a huge advantage of the impulse theme okay now let's move to the collections I think that I really like the collection features of Impulse theme because it offers you so many options to make your collection more than just a normal collection page, you know? I mean, if you look at the collection here, it's visually pleasing somehow because you can showcase big collection image in the header with parallax effect and the product grid looks very organized with large images and you can see the second image of the products as you hover your mouse on it like the example of the nanomax store here you can set up that option in the theme settings and go to products and then product grid customization and with banners here the captivating images and cda buttons all of these factors bring an exciting and cool browsing experience Mentioning the banner promotions once again is a powerful attribute. You can promote your products, best collections or discount event right on the collection page. And you can choose any promotion banner ties as same as the home page. With the collection filtering here, you can add sub collections under your parent collection. For example, I have the shop collection on the main menu bar like this. It contains bracelets, collection, necklace, collection, etc. Right? If I choose to show subs collections under the shop collection, you will see collection banners of necklace, bracelets, and you can navigate to these specific collections easily. Kappa USA, for example, they did a great job with it. Beside that, you can sort out your product by text colors or menus and for the mobile version of the collection page you can see it's very neat and compact the banners the product grid and the filtering menus are all packed in the small box like here pretty responsive right all in all the collection page features get very high score from us okay now let's move to the product page with product page the first feature i want to mention is the color swatches i know there are many other premium themes that also have this feature but it's still great to mention it because it helps improve user experience adding color options on the product pages with variant images changing through color selection can help visitors visualize the product better 
And another reason is to set up this option, you have to go to the theme settings, choose the product section. And now this is where you have more customizations for your products. You can enable color swatches for your product pages or collection pages. The filtering option, remember? And set contact form, additional content product description, or even add trust badge. You can add a logo there. Now get back here, the product story. What is this? And this is where you can add more content sections on the product page. You can add images with tag section, image or video, even map and testimonials and so on to promote your products and brand. Now I understand why this theme is called Impulse because you can see promotion attributes everywhere. The promotion grid on the home page, collection promotion banners, content sections on the product page to promote your brand, and even food promotions. They can make your store attractive enough that can encourage some people make their impulsive purchase. And finally, down here are some product recommendation options, which is good for upselling strategy. In general, with the number of extra features that Impulse theme offers, I think it's a true premium theme and worth trying. Do we like Impulse theme? Yes, we do. And I think it's worth the price because the theme is very modern and brings professional look for an e-commerce store. It has powerful promotion features, flexible customization options for header and footer, and is a more by first theme. The Akatai theme did a pretty good job with mobile responsiveness with this impulse theme, I have to say. And another reason why we like about this theme is is support documents. They are top notch. They cover most common problems and advanced issues with the theme, and you can follow their tutorials easily. I'll put the link in the description box below so you can check out there. However, there are some limitations with the Impulse theme that needs to be pointed out. Obviously, no theme is perfect, right? With content sections on many pages, uh, there are no customized options for adjusting padding or margin of the elements. So if you want a flexible design, you must edit the theme code or use a third-party page builder app like Pagefly, for example, to easily drag and drop and customize the themes elements the way you want. And Pagefly works fine with the Impulse theme, so if you want to insert it, you can try. And it would be better if the theme can support building a us or FAQ pages and many more. But I think in general, this theme would be highly rated by many people. So that's it. That's our review of the Impulse theme features. If you like the video, you can leave a thumbs up or comment down below. Also, you can tell us which Shopify themes do you want us to make a review in the comment section with the next videos. Once again, remember to subscribe to our Pagefly YouTube channel, click on the bell icon to get the notifications of our latest videos in the future. Thank you for watching and see you next time.